Welcome back to the lockdown on pushthebutton.ie. Thanks so much for checking out my videos and anybody who's hit subscribe on YouTube, thank you so much. And if you liked us on Facebook and Instagram, also, thank you so much. Today on the lockdown, my guest is a really nice guy. You know him off of TV and the founder of Kennedy & Co Skincare for Men. It's Darren Kennedy. <laughs> Darren Kennedy, how are you, buddy? I'm really good, Stephen. Thanks very much. I'm, I'm keeping sane, keeping uh, out of trouble. And, and I've got my little dog here who's in here. He's keeping me on my toes. That's Harry now. How are you? Bring, bring Harry into the picture. Oh, we Harry's, want to see Harry. Harry's in the picture. Harry's all over Hi, the picture. Harry. He's not missing Harry. <laughs> Man, we've got eight dogs at the moment. Eight? Eight, yeah, because our two dogs had puppies. Wow. So we now have uh, a litter of six, oh. which hope, uh, and we, we don't know when they're going to be able to go to the new homes. Like it should be in about six weeks. So uh, fingers crossed this will all what be dogs over. Are they? uh, they're Springer Spaniels. Oh, lovely, lovely. Are you yeah, doing, are you, are you they're gorgeous. Are you doing good now, are you? Are you doing good now? <laughs> there you go. I think, I think he's, he's okay for now. All right, Harry, relax. So, Darren, fill us in on what you've been doing because, you know, between TV work and your own brand, for anybody who doesn't know, let us know what it's all about. Yeah, well, I guess in between the TV, um, most recently in, on Irish TV, I've done things like uh, Buyer's Bootcamp, which is a, a property search series helping first-time buyers really navigate the whole process of buying houses, which can be very tricky, as we know, and giving them tips and tricks on you know, the bidding process and whatnot and how that works with Liz O'Kane, who's an expert in that field, and then Dancing with the Stars. And I have a new show, a new series called You Are What You Wear, starting on BBC One. And then oh, wow. on, alongside of all that, I would work with various other brands. I, I write uh, kind of as a columnist for various titles. And then I have my own brand, which you mentioned there, Kennedy & Co., which is a men's yes. uh, skin and hair care brand. And I say men's loosely because a lot of women are loving it too. Oh, all of the products, or is there any in particular that they're using? Um, women are loving the moisturizer because apparently makeup sits really well underneath it. It's also really good at, um, it's got SPF in there, so it's kind of like a two-in-one. The Pete Face oh. Group uh, is an excellent mask, and it's great for any kind of hormonal breakouts or adult acne. So getting some amazing feedback on them all. So for anyone who's interested, you'll pick them up in Dunn stores when you're doing your groceries or in pharmacies or online and shipping's really quick as well which is good to good to know look at look after yourself lads. exactly exactly <laughs> well listen now we've got more time in our hands you know yeah no so what are you doing like you're obviously going to be doing some work from home but like any day-to-day -day things that you've maybe got up to have you learned anything new have you looked at any tutorials on youtube or anything or well funny enough i started learning spanish in set in sorry in january i'd started because mm. uh, I, I studied spanish as part of it was my secondary language uh, when i was at university and i always loved it so I yeah. started doing uh, classes online, so I'm still doing them, and it's quite nice. And I've actually started to absorb kind of my my house has become like a little enclave of Spain. So I'm listening to Spanish music. I'm watching like La Casa de Papel or Money Heist and TV shows in Spanish just to try and kind of absorb more of it. While oh, I'm that's learning. amazing. And that's actually really quite nice. And um, I am working out from home, which is not ideal, but I'm looking that I have some dumbbells and a kettlebell and kind of put structure on my day. Harry we can see you now doing your star jumps on the, on the uh, sit room yeah, right yeah, now yeah, a few bits on the like carpet. Yeah. <laughs> and then Harry, of course, who's here, is keeping me, you know, add structure to my day and then a little bit of work. I mean, work isn't obviously as busy as it was before, but, uh, yeah. you know, there's, there's, plenty, there's plenty to keep me going and getting out for walks as well. Yeah, obviously within the two kilometer range. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Yeah. Um, so what, what, what do you want to do when this is all done? Like, is there anything that you just really, really miss doing? Having a social life. I mean, it's stating the obvious, yeah. but like I just spending time with my family, being able to give my mom and my dad a hug, you know, it's the simple things. And then obviously it's the extravagant things. Like I want to be able to go lie on a beach and do all those lovely things. But first and foremost, it's the, the simple everyday things and everyday freedoms that we, uh, I guess, took for granted. Yeah. Do you reckon uh, just with the behavior of uh, a lot of people online um, with their kindness and like there is a lot of trolls still going on, especially if you uh, visit Twitter, it's a horrible place. Um, do you reckon what has happened that when we're all allowed back into the wild, that society may become a different place? Uh, without a doubt. Yep. Yep. There's absolutely going to be uh, changes to how the economy works, to how society works. I think for a lot of people, this uh, pressing pause. I mean, obviously, there's a lot of people going through hardship in terms of mm. uh, people who've been ill and losing loved ones. And that's that's horrific. 
Um, and I think even if you haven't been touched by that type of grief and loss, we're, we're all experiencing something that we've never, and I say this all as an all Irish people and globally, that we've we probably never experienced again. So I, I think that can't not but have an impact and a lasting yeah. impact. Absolutely, I couldn't agree more. Well, Darren, thanks so much for taking time out and having a chat to us. Pleasure. Uh, you and Harry go for a little stroll. It's a beautiful day. And uh, stay safe, buddy. He's dying to get going. Okay, Stephen, listen, thanks very much. Nice to talk to you. Thanks to Darren Kennedy for coming on the lockdown. See all his links below for all the bits and pieces he's involved in. Thanks for subscribing, liking, and following. Share it with your friends, and we'll see you next time.